Hello everyone, this is FNH here with a brand new video to talk about how to record your MacBook screen for free. Um, it's actually pretty straightforward and easy to do. It just kind of sucks that Apple does not really explain how to do this, so sad. But I'm going to walk you through this uh, step by step. So there's two ways you can do this. The simplest way I've personally found and like is on your keyboard, just press the command shift and five button uh, all together. Uh, I believe it should be the same all across Macs. I tried it on a couple of friends and it works. So I, that was my verification personally, but give that a shot. So once you press command shift five, you will see all these different options pop up. Right now, obviously I'm using it to record. So it's a little different, but you can see how it works. You can do the capture entire screen, capture selected window, capture selected portion. So this is a screenshot. Um, there's also a second portion that shows you the recording aspect of things. And that's what I'm currently, as you can see, it says stop recording. I'm using right now. Um, just to show you in the options, you have the option on where you want to save it. Is it the desktops, the documents, clipboard, mail, et cetera, et cetera, and other locations. I'm assuming if you have like a YouTube folder or a projects folder or whatever you're doing. A timer on when the recording should stop, start. Uh, I have it on five seconds. Um, and then you can have like where, what, what was it? Like the show floating thumbnail, show last selection, show mouse pointer. I don't do the mouse pointer, I think. Um, so yeah, and then obviously you have the capture, which is currently happening. Uh, the next thing you can do to, uh, or the second way you can do the recording is if you have QuickTime Player opened, uh, just right click into it and over here, <coughs> excuse me, you have the options of new movie recording, new audio recording or new screen recording. The reason why I don't like this one is you can't really record your audio. You, um, for some reason you have to do what I just did to be able to record your audio because in there you have the options and then you can select which microphone. I'm using like an external mic right now, like a lavalier mic. You can use the obviously the MacBook mic or you can use whatever you want to a blue Yeti or something of the sort. But as you can see, there, you can do it from here as well. Uh, again, I don't like using this because it's weird. Uh, it doesn't record the audio. I personally want to record my audio, so this works well for me. And um, so just doing Command Shift 5 works. So yeah, guys, uh, I do hope you guys found this video helpful and informative. It's, like I said, extremely simple and easy to do. Uh, that's all you gotta do and you'll be easily able to record your Mac. Uh, or your screen record your Mac and it's free. That's the best part. It's free. You don't need to get Camtasia or anything of the cr cr sort or anything crazy. Um, you obviously have iMovie Maker in this in the Mac as well for free and you can do all your editing there. Especially if you're a new YouTuber, I would highly recommend you just recording for free, getting like a lavalier mic. Don't go crazy on a Yeti or anything of the sort. The Mac's internal mic is fine as well, but obviously I would prefer something like even a lavalier is good enough. Get something like a lavalier is five ten dollars. Plug that in. Do all your editing in iMovie, again, free. Don't need to go crazy. Don't need to get the Final Cut Pro. I think that's the three, $400 one. Um, I, if anything, I don't know if Macs have Camtasia, but my next suggestion would be Camtasia. But if they don't have Camtasia, then I, I'll i make another video on like the softwares to get for Macs for video editing purposes. But yeah, guys, uh, this was it. Let me know in the comment section below if you have any comments, questions, concerns, and on that, FNH out. Peace.